Hi and welcome in this video from Teach Me How to Trade Forex and Binary Option. My name is Damien Levy. Support and Resistance Series, Lesson 6. Big candles, there is four lessons on this topic. In this lesson you will learn where big candle happens, meaning of a big candle when appears at a turning point, strategy in binary option, strategy for forex. In the last lesson, the last two types of turning point that we saw highlight an important clue in the market, the big candles, or powerful moves. The big candle position at turning points are very important. When the most recent turning point of any support and resistance level shows a strong rejection candles, it is likely that the level will hold even for a bit the next time it will touch it again. Let's look at some examples. Strong rejection candles at support and resistance and consequences. On this chart we have this support line and when the price leaves the level it leaves it with strength with a big candle. Its size is from 20% and above of the 10 previous candles. Then the price reverses violently and attacks the support with big candles. But even with strength, it can't break it right away and needs to range for a while. Other example... On this specific chart, I try to show you every big candle's impact on price when it comes back to the beginning of the big candle. To set your support and resistance line, you, you will use the average of the week that I showed you in the previous lesson. So first example, we have this very big candle creating a turning point. I draw a yellow dotted line and when price comes back to it, it rejects. Second big candle from a turning point, important. I draw my yellow line at the average of the week and look what the price comes back to it, strong rejection. Last one, this one has a resistance, not a support, big candle from the top. I draw my line average of the week and what we have a strong rejection when you come back to it. Those big candles at turning point can be used in binary option for example if you use daily chart to plot your levels and take the end of the next day as expiration. Let's look at example together. So I take again the EURUSD daily chart and for me the daily time frame is the strongest. So we have this big candle creating a turning point. I draw a line average of the week and my entry is exactly at the level for the expiration at the end of the next candle after the touch. It's a winning trade. Other one, big candle starting from a newly created turning point. I draw my line average of the week and same happen. It's a winning end of the next candle after the first touch. And my entry is the first touch. Same big candle entry average of the week expiration end of the next and it's a winning trade also. I wouldn't use a chart below the 15 minute chart for this strategy and the lower the time frame, the less reliable it is. For Forex now, since we search moves of good size, we will place our level for example on the daily, then we will take our entry using the 15 minute chart with a M or W pattern, like explained in the video dedicated on it. We will aim for a risk of 1 and a reward of 2, and when the reward 1 is reached, I move my stop loss to break even. Let's look at a detailed example together. So this is your USD daily chart. In this example, so daily time frame will be stronger. I find this very big bearish candle. First I define a strong resistance or support from a big candle at a turning point. 
then I go to the 15 minute chart when the price will come back to it and back at the level I see the level touch and make a nice M formation confirmed by the 13 EMA so my entry is there, my stop loss is here my risk is 26 pips so when the price reach 26 pips I move my stop loss to break even at my entry point and I let run my trade until it touch the 200% payout which is the reward of 2 so 52 pips on this specific example to summarize this lesson when a big candle appears from a high or low we can expect a rejection even little when the price comes back to the level a binary option strategy is to enter at the next touch of the beginning of this big candle level for a one candle expiry after the touch we trade the charts that we analyze I would recommend to use the 15 minute chart minimum for this strategy the higher the time frame the better the probability of success will be for Forex we select the level on a higher time frame daily for our chart for example and we will enter our trade near the level with a M or W pattern using the 15 minute chart the risk reward that I advise is one risk two reward lastly for all the strategy I present I advise you to trade the major pairs at first because they have more liquidity and therefore less subject to manipulation those are the EURUSD, GBPUSD, USDGPY, USDCAD, USDCHF and odd USD. once you master those you can trade the cross pairs we are already at the end of this video thank you for watching Please like and share and join us on Facebook, the link are below the video. Comment if you want me to do a video on a specific topic about trading. And if you need a quality broker, I recommend IC Market and my link is below if you need. I have tested a lot of brokers in the past for Forex and IC Market is a true ECN broker regulated in Australia and the one that I personally use and the best we have found so far with very very good condition to trade. I publish video every week so subscribe to my channel to be updated. I wish you all the best. Bye!